Hi everyone, welcome to Ask LKC Medicine. I'm Lim Rong from the class of 2025 and with me... I'm Fujita from the class of 2024. Today we'll be answering your questions about LKC Medicine. Let's go! Well, for the Year 1 and Year 2 students, we typically have about two full-day lessons a week. These are our TBLs and we have usually two half-day lessons a week. There usually is protected time on Wednesday afternoons. This will allow us to pursue our own interests. So for the clinical years from year 3 to 5, you'll be posted through the different hospitals. So you'll be going every single day. Timings can vary. You can sometimes try as early as 7, 30, 7, and you can even start at 9 a.m. And your ending time also varies. It can be at the half-day period of like 12 p.m. all the way to 5 and 6. But nonetheless, you're just there to really experience the clinical years, to learn from your tutors and have fun as well. But the Wednesday protected time is still appreciated in the clinical years as well. And we don't normally have classes on weekends. And if there are classes, they're usually optional and usually for the interest of students. You can go to your respective JC, Poly or any school guidance counsellors or career teachers. They'll give you more information about what are the, some of the internship opportunities that are linked to your school or sometimes just the general intern opportunities that are catered to your own interest. Apart from that, you can sign up via the health, different healthcare institution websites. Just keep a look out. You can go to the NHG portal like National Healthcare Group or you can just look at NUHS and just go to different websites. That being said, job shadowing and internships are not a requirement for you to apply to LKC Medicine. However, at least in my personal experience, I feel that it's a good way for you to find out whether medicine is the right fit for you and to find out more about the job. It is true that the school looks mainly at academic results. However, there are other things that LKC Medicine will look at on top of your academic results. So there's factors that are unique to LKC. So number one will be the BMAT, the Biomedical Admissions Test. This part tests your content knowledge in the sciences. Then there's parts that test on your deductive reasoning and a section that tests on your written ability. But also unique to LKC Medicine will be the multiple mini-interviews that test your personality and to see whether or not you're the right fit for medicine and just to get to know you in a more formal setting and get to know you personally as well. There is this scheme called the Aptitude-Based Admission Scheme where LKC Medicine will consider co-curricular and extracurricular activities. So anything outside your academics. This may include your leadership qualities, to service, to any outstanding co-curricular achievements. And this can play a part in your application. Well, regardless of your results, if you feel that medicine is a career that you really wish to pursue and you really wish to study in LKC Medicine, I would encourage you to still put in your application because every year the cutoff varies and LKC Medicine will consider all applications that come their way. Okay, so for LKC, the main research period is your year 4 year where you have a 6 week scholarly project where you can choose a research project be in terms of going into laboratories or you can also do medical education, anything that you wish. There's also a short primer period in year 3 where they do expose you a bit to the research environment and experience. But with regards to your question on year 1 and 2, I personally feel that there are many opportunities for you to engage in research. Personally, when I was in year 1 and year 2, I engaged on a project regarding zebrafish. We have a lot of professors that teach us who are engaged in their, in their own research. And if you're proactive, if you're interested, you can reach out to them and they would consider working with you on a project together. There are many opportunities for you to engage in research with our world-class research facilities, our prominent scientists and clinicians working in LKC Medicine. In my experience, depending on the type of scholarship, scholarship holders usually have some sort of living allowance and depending on the tier of scholarship as well, they receive subsidies for their school fees as well as their hall fees. However, once everybody starts school in year one, everybody has equal access to opportunities. And where these opportunities are eventually awarded to depend on a person's proactiveness as well as merit. Definitely, at LKC Medicine, we have this unique program called the Hospital Week and Polyclinic Week, where we get early clinical exposure to real life patients. So personally, I went to Tan Tok Seng Hospital and Woodlands Polyclinic when I was in year one. What about you, Pajita? I went to Khu Teck Wat Hospital in my hospital week and I think the most memorable experience I had was that this was my first few weeks in medical school in year one and I got to talk to patients and just talking to them and finding out their experiences made me realise what the doctor I wanted to be in year five. And it really set a primer for my clinical years later on.